After a two-year absence due to the pandemic, the Women's Place Book Riot returned to the Gale Center on Wednesday. Judging by the crowd on hand, the iconic fundraiser has been missed. The energy in this room is so fun. Everybody's so happy to return. Our volunteers are happy to be back in action. And us as staff at Women's Place are so pleased that the community is lending their support once again for the 43rd Book Riot event. Having a, a bit of an absence with this event, did you have a sense of how the community w would respond? I know it's early here on day one. Yeah, you know what? We weren't sure and we did change the date of our pre-sales. So we were hoping that we got the message out there to as many people as possible. So we're really pleased with the turnout for the first 30 minutes. And it seems to be a steady uh, trend of people coming into shops. So we're hopeful that we'll have another successful event. I understand the city stepped up again in terms of the facility. Absolutely. So we're very thankful to the city of Niagara Falls for waiving the venue fee, which would have been well over $6,000. That money that is saved can go directly back into helping the women and children who access our services. I also wanted to acknowledge that we do have a major event sponsor, Home Instead Senior Care. They not only lend financial support year after year now, but they also lend their muscle and strength and, and volunteer for this event. Quite a few from their, their staff team come out and join us. So we're very thankful for the ongoing partnership with both of those uh, partners of ours. Melissa Patterson has once again gone above and beyond in terms of her dedication to Women's Place. Her and her husband will spend over a week in Niagara Falls setting up the book right, working the sale, and tearing down the Gale Center before heading back home to Sault Ste. Marie. We've been helping set up tables, unload books, and doing garbage, just about anything. I also have three sisters, two of whom help out at the sale regularly as well, so it's become somewhat of a family affair for us. So this is a chance to see your mom, but it's yeah. also a, a commitment to a cause as well. Is there anything sure. specifically that touches you about the sale or women's place? Do you know what? Um, it's always upset me that women can't uh, feel safe in their own home. So for me, it's, it's about women having a safe place to go and knowing that we can help make that happen for them and that the ladies and the staff at the women's shelter at Women's Place, just they are totally committed, the board, the volunteers all year long. And then the other part of it is books. I've always loved books. I've been a book lover since I was a kid. So the two things came together and it just seemed like a natural fit. Much of the work that goes into the book riot takes place off site. Scores of dedicated volunteers spend countless hours sorting through the donated items at Apple self storage. So organizing these books, you cannot believe what goes on. These, are, these books are organized alphabetically, these fiction books. There are probably over 150,000 of them and they just take the time and organize them day after day after day in the storage unit. It's, when I went into volunteer, it's like something you've never seen, the commitment. I've never seen anything like that. Just, and the, these people are older, like, you know, like a lot of the volunteers are in their 60s and 70s and sitting on a floor in a storage unit sorting books, making sure they're clean and making sure they're, you know, if they're vintage books, if they've got inscriptions, just making sure when people donate even, are you sure this is, you know, do you want to donate these books? Some of these books look like they're, they're heirlooms, they're, you know, just all of that, right? The book riot runs through Sunday at the Gale Center. All sales are cash only. Please get out and support Women's Place at their biggest yearly fundraiser. In Niagara, you're watching The Source on your TV.